Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Damn. Alright guys, vlog three. We're starting today's vlog at Mountain Vista Medical Center. We're starting it at a hospital, okay? So this is where I'm gonna be at for the next three months working as a physical therapy student. And I wanted to come today to just check it out, make sure I don't get lost on Monday morning. Uh, I don't really wanna look like, I don't know what I'm doing Monday morning, so I came to scope it out beforehand. Um, as far as today goes, I know me and Paige are going to go to Atomic Blonde, so we're probably going to do a movie review there. Uh, we're probably going to hit up the gym. We're just going to go ahead and get our day started. Ah. I'll give you an update. We're currently driving to the movies. I believe we're gonna watch, what is it? Atomic Blonde. We're gonna watch Atomic Blonde right now. And afterwards, we might do a little review to kinda let you guys know what it was like and if it's even worth going to watch. Um, this is Paige, by the way, if you guys didn't know. I'm really excited to see this movie. I love action movies and I love Charlie Theron, so I'm excited to see what it's about. Let's go. It's an impressive set of skills. <laughs> All right, everybody. Uh, we just got home from Atomic Blonde. It was uh, it was interesting. It was kind of slow for an action movie. It was really confusing. There was a lot of betraying back and forth. I left confused. She says she knows what what happened. So <laughs> I felt like I was guessing the whole time. I don't even know what the story was even about. I just know that. She kicked everyone's ass. Uh, I don't know. I think it was pretty good. I think it's well written. Um, it's oh, a, well written. Yeah, it's the same director as John Wick. Oh, okay. I felt like it was poorly written, but the action scenes were great. I think that she kicked everyone's ass. Let's just say there's a corkscrew used a couple times. Yeah, um, definitely some stabbing and goriness. Um, and then, of course, the super hot lesbian scene that no one can get over. <laughs> oh, okay. People are giving it criticism because they're like, well, I feel like I was so lost the whole time I watched it. Or a lot of people said it's super cliche and that the character herself was super bland. And I, did, I thought she was super sexy and mysterious. And so I really keen on it. So. You heard it from us. I gave it a 6.5. 8. She gives it an eight. Um, I would say it's not bad to watch if you go watch it. I would say it's probably worth the money, but I wouldn't pay for it twice. All right, guys. So it's now 7 p.m. Some time's passed since we watched the movie. Um, we ended up going to the gym. Boom shakalaka! I watched the motocross races that were on today, so those take up a good portion of the day. Um, yeah, so now we're at Walmart. That's about it. What are strawberries? What are those strawberries for? Oh, you'll see. Raspberries, blueberries, and blackberries. What in the... Why are you getting all these berries? It's got schemes up my sleeves. Ah, schemes up her sleeves. Look at all those chickens. All right, y'all, so that's the end of vlog number three. I know it wasn't too exciting, but thank you, thank you if you're still watching right now. I appreciate your time. Uh, leave a comment, like, subscribe, do whatever you want to do. Um, like I said, I know it wasn't too exciting today. My next vlog is going to be pretty lit. Um, that's why I had the fruit in the previous frames. That's, uh, we're going to end up doing something with that, so stay tuned there. I think it's gonna be pretty litty. Hey, let's go. I wanna get that vlog four. Let's go. <laughs>